Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to uh, install ceramic tile. So, um, talking about tiles like this that already have a backing, uh, so they already have like a net behind it, like this. So I'm going to install it on the wall at this area here. And uh, I'm going to be using something called the simple mat which are um, stickers like they're they're actually glue on on both sides so um, so you peel off this particular side right here and you stick it to the wall just like that and this side right here is a clear film that has not been removed yet and I'm going to remove that later on when we are ready to uh, stick on the tile and so right now I'm just setting it in place and putting it all over the wall. Um, it's really easy to use. All you have to do is just prepare the wall, making sure that the uh, wall surface is free of dust to make sure that this sticks really good. Once you do that, and uh, you're just going to prepare the tile, stick it on, cut the tile to the right shape, and then put mortar on it. Um, or grout, sorry, not mortar. Yeah, so we're actually not using mortar. When you're using simple mat, you're not using mortar. You're just sticking the tile to the wall. Okay, so I'm gonna get to work and I'm going to show clips um, step by step as I am sticking it to, uh, sticking the, uh, the simple mat to the wall and then later on when I put the tile on and then when also when I uh, put the grout on and then finally when it's finished, okay? Okay, so this stuff is really easy to uh, control or customize because you can just cut it using a regular scissor and uh, so you cut it to any kind of shape and size. Uh, as you can see here, I have some this size, this size, so this is really easy. So just like arts and crafts, you just cut them, stick them and uh, put the tile later. Okay, so this particular area here, um, I have just peeled off the, uh, the protective cover. So now it's ready for me to stick on this first piece. So the thing about uh, this particular um, tile is that this is the hardest part right here is, is to make sure that when you stick it, especially the first piece is perfect because if this is crooked, the rest of your wall will be completely crooked. So make sure your first piece is exactly right. Okay, I usually just kind of pound on it to make sure that everything sticks really good. And um, the edges here, these, uh, the ones that is kind of like sticking out by itself, sometimes can get crooked. So you want to make sure that uh, they're all straight. The last ones also sometimes can get crooked. And I usually just press them also with my fingers, the one on the edges, make sure that they stick to the glue. And this is very quick. As you can see, you just stick and keep on going. But this is, you have to make sure that everything is stuck really good. Every tile needs to be somewhat glued attaching to the back, to the drywall. Okay, that's our first piece. Okay, on this second piece here, I'm immediately running into some challenges. So this, uh, so we have two 
issues here. One is that we have to cut around this wall outlet. Secondly, we have to cut around this ledge, this window ledge. So what I usually will do is that uh, I will um, stick on the first part and some of the edges and I'm gonna take a pen or marker and I'm going to pencil or mark out all the parts that I need to cut out. And then I'm gonna cut them and then find, do the final stick on. So first, I would like to do just some part of it stick on, but I don't want it to be too uh, permanent. So this is just a temporary stick on so that I can get an idea where things are. So this is not permanent. I'm not gonna press on it. Um, but I am going to try to get it leveled like that okay so that allows me to see where the uh, outlet is exactly and where do i need to cut also on the side here approximately okay i got it marked here so now i'm going to try to remove it as careful as I can. Make sure you don't pull out the uh, the glue that is stuck on the wall. Okay, there you go. And now you have the exact template where to cut and then uh, you should just go ahead and cut it. I have just finished uh, sticking all the ceramic tiles uh, to the uh, gluing pad and right now just uh, pressing them in just to make sure that uh, there is no loose tile as you can see it's uh, pretty easy to go around um, pipes and outlets etc so this was about probably um, six or seven square feet only and uh, it was pretty fast uh, it took me about two hours two and a half hours uh, from start to finish uh, to complete this and um, I think the, it was uh, very well worth it um, the process was pretty easy in my opinion so the next thing we're going to do is uh, we are going to uh, apply the grout on it and wait until it dries Okay, I've just completed the uh, grouting process and uh, we're using this sparkle white kind of uh, uh, grout. It looks uh, really good. It has like a lot of sparkles and uh, right now we're just waiting for it to dry. So um, uh, this is it really, um, kind of conclude this video. So as you can tell, um, the finished look is just like regular tile if you were to use um, uh, what do you call it uh, uh, regular um, masonry I meant to say um, mortar or um, mastic whatever they, they use to to stick the uh, the tile to the drywall as usual but we're using sticker uh, by simple mat and I'm gonna put the link in the description uh, you can buy that from Amazon, it's pretty cheap and it's the, by far the, the, the fastest way for you to install um, tile. So this whole process here took me approximately about probably three and a half hours to four hours total and uh, 
and uh, for, for the look of it what we we're trying to achieve I think is very well worth it thank you for watching and as usual uh, if you find this uh, video useful please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel I'm trying to get to a thousand subscriber and hopefully you can help me out um, hope to get uh, to a thousand subscriber before uh, November election 2020 thank you for watching bye thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel to see more do it yourself